Previously on The Walking Dead. Who do you think did this? Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? What's the most important thing in this world? Clem, it's family. People like Matthew aren't coming back. Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. Ah! Go to hell, you f We're going home. As a family. Bro, you can't force nobody to be a part of your family, bro. What? <laughs> What's going on, Clem? You about done over there? Yeah, one second. Thanks for coming with me. It's scary out here. I know they made you. It's still nice that you came. We're friends. Friends look out for one another. We are, aren't we? Well, if you need to pee, let me know. I'll keep look out for you, too. Uh, okay. I mean, I guess we still friends. She's still saving me, bro. I, I owe her that. Everything come out all right, girls? Get your creep ass on. Troy, get him tied up. Will do. Well, we're on our way. Probably 30 minutes out. Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carver out. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk back. Nope. Froze my ass off. Just like you told me to. It ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. Has anyone ever taught you that? I'ma kill you. I'm gonna kill you! <laughs> no, stop! Don't hit my friend! You don't wanna test me, girl. I'll pass every time. I'm gonna kill you. Give me the option to say that. Leave her alone. Tie her up and throw her in with the rest of them. <laughs> Fuck you, bruh. Fuck all y'all. I'm killing everybody. If you give me a gun, I'm clapping shit. Fuck him. Fuck her. Man, look. Fuck him. In. I'm about to infiltrate, bro. Don't give me the opportunity to infiltrate. Are you guys okay? The hell did he do to you? Hey, did he hurt you? Hey, hey! Kenny, be cool, bro. I'm gonna handle this. I'm gonna handle this, my boy. Bleed that. I'd rather die than be kept captive, bro. I can't believe people will allow this shit. Like, you know, let somebody run them. Like this dude Carver doing. Y'all scared of this man or something? Overthrow the government, bro. You about to turn into a savage. I ain't gonna hold you. All right, we got to do something. Come on. Anyone got anything sharp? Anything? We need to get these bindings off. Hey, Clem, help me find something to get these off. Anything sharp that could cut these. And what good is that going to do? The hell is wrong with you people? We got to get out of here. The truck's empty. First off, we're in it, so it ain't exactly empty. If you don't want to help, then just say so, okay? I'll do it myself. We're in a fucking precarious position here. We gotta do something about Settle that. Down, Kenny. Yo, cool they it, nigga. Everything. We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill? This whole time it's Carver, Carver, Carver. Now he's fucking Bill. Oh, I see what it is. 
Y'all are just getting a ride home, aren't you? That's what's going on here. Say that again. I'd stay out of this, boy. Mister, I ain't a boy. No, right. You're a man. Facts. You don't understand. He's different. It's worse. The fuck are you talking about? He wants to punish us. What do you mean, worse? He's a fucking psychopath now. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, he gave me a pretty good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that happen to the rest of us. I'm trying to help! I'm sure Walter really appreciated your help. That's not fair! You're blaming him for the actions of a madman! I am pointing out that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Something that he seems to be misreading as capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying, but I know it's bullshit. We have to do something. Kenny! You can't reason with him. Oh shit. Jackpot! Check me out. Sit down. Going to get they should have put. They should have told me about this nigga up front. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know that. Yeah. Well, I've been in this situation before. You ever been a prisoner? Kenny's right. We have to do something. We can't just sit here. How is it the kid is the only one that sees what's going on here? Clem, the adults are talking. Fuck you. Is that what this is? All right. Clem got now more strength than all y'all. Carver will be on the other side of that door with ten people. <laughs> There, there, baby. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. If he was gonna do something, he'd have done it by now. Who knows what he's dealing with? Anything can happen out there. I'll tell you what happened. He abandoned us. You don't know that. I know he ain't here. He may not be around, but he wouldn't just leave us behind. We'll have to wait and see. It's all we can do. She's right. There's no way to know what's happened to him. I told you already. He's gone. We don't know that for sure. That's real. We're close. Okay, let's do this. They have guns. What exactly do you expect to do? I'm gonna punch the first son of a bitch I see. Then I'm gonna take his gun and use it to shoot the next son of a bitch I see. Just sit down. Shut up, Doc. This ain't your call. Hey, just, if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't, you know, get yourself hurt or nothing, but any help would be good. Kenny is irrational. Hey, Clem. Look at me. I understand. You trust me, right? Kenny, please, just... I trust Kenny. Yeah. Okay, I trust you. I'll... I'll do what I can. All right. It's okay to be a little scared, but we gotta do this. All right. Everybody ready? Kenny! Uh, Kenny, are you okay? Is he okay? <laughs> I think so. Oh, what hit me? It's probably for the best. Damn. That nigga got knocked God, out. Damn, brakes ain't working for shit. All right, up and at him. Oh, I'm... Oh. The fuck? How'd you get your restraints off? Come here. We've got some familiar faces back with us tonight. Now, I understand some of you are confused as to why we bring these people back when they left us as they did. I think I've got an idea. Now, it might not come all at once, but time will heal these wounds. Be patient with them until it does. You take solace in knowing that they're here to help us make our home a better place. All these feelings you have of anger, betrayal, hate, they're all valid. No one needs to forget what they did. But we do have to find it in our hearts to forgive them. Look how much. Bro, if a nigga don't want to stay, let him go. Oh, I hope you ain't saying what I think you're saying. Many of you already know a large herd of lurkers gathers just south of us. Come on, we need you for something. Can I wait until morning? We're all exhausted. Just come the fuck on. I need him. I need my dad. I, I can't. He's... He looks after me. They have been taken into consideration. However, this is not up for debate. The expansion project... I want to tell the group, man. Grow up, Sarah. You're gonna get us in trouble. I don't care. And don't tell me to grow up. You're just a little kid. I'm older than you. Nigga, you ain't got strengths like me. Hit. I've been out here. You a little ass kid, nigga. I'm, 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 nigga I got bodies. Nigga, you a little man, kid in the crib. Wait, my daddy. I've been out here fucking, man. Don't ever talk to Make me like sure that. Make sure y'all stay off the fence. Bill can see if you're messing with it. Just to survive. 
survive. It's our obligation to make this community a beacon of hope. Thanks, Barney. Yep. To provide a light, a bright light, bright enough to shine in all this darkness. So that is what we'll do. Y'all best get some rest, because there ain't gonna be much for you tomorrow. You're gonna be working hard. That's for you. Yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold, but at least I'll be comfortable. Hey, guys. Richie! <gasps> Man, what happened to you? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What did they do to you? This could have been worse, trust me. I'm lucky to be alive. It's my fault. No, it's really not. I would tell you if it was. This happened well after you guys left. I guess I should say Reggie helped us you, but when we ran away. I know. I feel the same way. What happened to his arm? I don't know. We were all running out together, but then he fell. And everybody kept running. I know he had both his arms then. If you fall, get your bitch ass up. They got me working outside. Lurker snuck up on me while I was hammering something. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Look, it was my choice to help you guys. Alvin, Carver wants you in his office. What? Why? Don't make this difficult. It's too late for that. No, please. It's okay, Beck. Just get some rest. If he wanted to do something to me, he'd have done it already. He about to. I'll be fine. He about to. He about to fuck you up. Let's see what he wants. You the other nigga. You the other nigga, for real. Hey, Reggie. Oh, hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. Don't mention it. Or fuck y'all. Boy, when that K get to spitting, I ain't sparing none of y'all on the other side. Oh, right. Let me introduce you. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's Sarita. Hello. And that's Kenny. Hey. Uh. Hello. Who are you? This freaks you out. My name's Clementine. It's very nice to meet you, Clementine. Give me the real. Hey, where's Carlos? Bill's already got him looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? Yeah. Can you guys save it for the morning? Man, shut your bitch ass up! Some of us gotta be up early. What a jerk. Clementine, please, you haven't even met him yet. Oh, she's not wrong. No problem. Sorry about that. Okay, that's Mike. He's kind of a dick when he's tired, but... Like I said, he saved my life, so I put up with that shit. Bill put him to work outside the wall with me. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, he said once you were all caught, he'd let me rejoin the group, so I'm glad you're here. I'm just joking. Who that dirty-ass girl is? I mean, he did say that, but I'm not happy about it. She's watching us. Hmm? What's that? The woman over there is watching us. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so she's fucking weird. They found her sneaking around outside the camp covered in guts and just, like, the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stare. Remember what Lee told you? I know how it must look, but it's really not that bad here. Reggie. No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff, and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh food. The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced labor, but that's only temporary. They've even got the solar panels working. When was the last time you had electricity, huh? Well, we just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. Damn! I'm just saying, it's not as bad as you think. We're building something great here, guys. A real community. Bill is making it happen. I ain't staying here. Look, I've made mistakes, and he's forgiven me. It feels more like a prison. Well, that is a very negative attitude. She's right, Reggie. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? What do you think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please just try not to cause any trouble? 
At least until they release me. Then, once I'm out, I could help you more. Maybe even help get you out. No way. Fucking A, no way. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night and chat again tomorrow. Keep it real. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Look, the fact is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all gone, but he's given me a second chance, and I know he'd do the same for you. Fuck him! Reggie, I don't want a second chance. I want to leave with my family. That's it. Your family is safer here. Safer here, nigga? I need to sit down. Somebody yeah, should smack on. the shit out Sarah, you. Sarah, can you go see if there's something for her to drink? Okay. Yeah, there's water over by the benches. Ah, oh, that didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Man, fuck that guy. I don't think we can trust him. I mean, clearly he's already drank too much of the Kool-Aid. I don't trust him either. He acts... strange. Yeah. I guess getting part of your body chopped off can do that to a fella. You gotta take a look around. We gotta know if there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. We're in a tight spot. Gonna have to wriggle our way out. Sure, I'll have a look around. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference on him. Man, I'm trying to get the fuck on, man. I, I just don't want nothing to happen to Kenny. I feel like Kenny's exposable. Walker just snuck up on you, huh? Yep. I was uh, distracted. Just wasn't thinking. Uh, I have to talk to this clown. Hello. Get lost. I remember that, nigga. I will remember that. Like you've done it before. Still think he got higher than he needed to, but Clementine's like straight face is hilarious, bro. Hey Clem. Nick. Just thinking about Lou. Just there's no way he's gone. That he left. How about it? Yeah, like I said, it felt like Cause me, I've known him for damn near 20 years now, and I can't buy it. Of course, I can't say the thought never crossed my mind. I, mean, I don't think Things so. Things change. Whole damn world change. I think you're right. He'd never leave you guys behind. Us guys, you mean? Yeah, us guys. <sighs> Guess I'll try and get some sleep. You should too. They're gonna ride our asses tomorrow for sure. Okay. Nice. So how did you, you know, like they're gonna try to do the whole, the whole Ben thing, like make no, him okay. more likable. Because at the end of well, season one, US, Ben was so likable, I wanted him to stay around, well, even though he fucked up so much. Game, so I told her, but it's cool though. Then I hmm, there looks I rickety. For five minutes, and that's when I thought I should really get out ahead of this. Keep talking to him. Looks kind of crappy. Looks kind of crappy, bro. We're in a crappy situation. How they gonna force me to work, bro? It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Mm. Hey, Clem, come on. Don't be like that. She ain't doing nothing wrong, Reggie. Just relax. How can I relax when she's walking around touching everything? Nigga, I'm just touching it, bro. Just seeing how how strong this fortification is. Ouch. Damn, bro. They really trying to keep a nigga in, huh? Really trying to keep a nigga in. I'm just making sure everything is everything. <laughs> All right, so we pretty much checked everything, I would assume. But I'm going to go ahead and do the full, you know, the full 360. Just to make sure I didn't touch or something I didn't touch. Okay, so yeah, 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 yeah. We, we, we looked at everything. I can't believe these. Man, I don't know, man. 
you can always overthrow the government, bro. But if you a dude with a gun, you just acting like a bitch at this point, listening to another man. Let me in that circle, man. Man, they making me walk all over. I couldn't just talk to him from the other side of the pit, bro. Hell no. Bro, really? Well, out with it. Do you see any way out of here? The fences seem pretty strong. Yeah, they do. All right. A whole house full of building supplies? I guess it ought to be. Alright, go the fuck to sleep. I'm shooting the first one of y'all I see wandering around before sunup. Troy, where's Alvin? Everybody get to bed. You dead. You don't even know her, bro. You, I'm smoking you. Everybody with a gun getting smoked. Some of these folks ain't too keen on leaving. It's up to us to figure out a way out of here. You up for it? Nigga, yes, nigga. It's your decision. I'm ready. Of course I am. Good, good. Confidence is good. You gotta have the right attitude. Now get some sleep. We'll need it. I'm riding with Kenny, man. That's my day one. He need to be a little calmer, though, and figure shit out first, because he don't be having no plans. But I'm, I'm down with Kenny, man. I'm down with Kenny. But you, you finna get clapped. Don't kick me. It's rude. Get up. Bill's gonna have a word. Troy might remember that. Fuck it, remember it, bro. I said it. Troy won't have a man. Fuck him. Fuck all of them. Carver, whatever his name is, William Bill. There's been increased walker activity along the fence, so be mindful when outside the walls. The herds moved a little closer as of this morning, but that still doesn't necessarily mean we'll be hit. No, we're monitoring the situation. Now. There are some folks might be sore about what happened, and how things went. Well, that's all in the past now. Some of you are new to our community. Some of you are members who went astray. But know that you can find redemption here, forgiveness, by proving your worth through what will undoubtedly be hard work. Reggie, you're nearly back in. Keep following the path, and we'll welcome you back with open arms. How'd you sleep? I'll let Reggie be an example I'm to you all. I'm so tired. Salvation is available. Shut Kenneth will be up. taking over Reggie's well, duties outside the wall. you don't have to be rude wall. about it. Michael will continue on I showing his value. I just thought it was nice to finally... Carlos! Yes? Your child seems to be in need of correction. I'm sorry. I... Sarah... Apologize to Mr. Carver. Should have shut a fucking mouth. I'm um, sorry, sir. No, no, that ain't gonna cut it. I can't have this kind of behavior on day one of your reform. You discipline her now, Carlos. How do you propose that one I? One good smack across the mouth should do it. It'll make her think twice before opening it up again. Go on, we'll wait. Do it. I'm not for it, but Wait. you, she need it. What do you mean by that? I'm not sure with my hand that I. Well, could. that's why you got two hands, Carlos. Come on, You're not some namby pammy thing, all right? A good hard smack. Otherwise, Troy here will do it for you. I don't think you want that. He can be overzealous. Is that the word? If it means I'll slap the shit out of her, then yeah. Go on, Carlos. No, you don't need to do that. She's already scared. She won't do it again. Hey, no one's fucking talking to you. You're gonna die. Unless you want one of what she's about to get, I'd pipe down, Missy. I'm gonna kill you too. Both of y'all. <laughs> you better not let me double tap because I'm gonna empty a clip. Hey, it is what it is. I told I'm her to sorry, shut up. Dad. I'm Close sorry. Close your eyes, honey. It's only going to sting for a second. Sorry. I told you to shut the fuck up. Keeping it real, I told you shut the fuck up. 
do it. Holy oh shit! shit. Oh, I want me to laugh for damn. Knock the fuck out. Oh. I'm sorry, sir. Stop! You're not coddling that girl anymore. Let her sit there and think about what she's done. Troy, get Carlos to his post. Everyone else should have their assignments. Damn. It's time to get to work. Don't worry, I'll avenge you. God damn. You really knocked the shit out of her, Doc. Everyone get to work. Yeah, he ain't had to go that hard, bro. Don't look at You're me, I told you to shut the fuck up. Me. I told you to shut the fuck up, bro. You ain't want to listen. Soil, let me up. God damn this thing. Oh, shit. Clementine. Oh, Mother Love, the black woman, she getting clapped too. Go on inside. Bonnie's waiting. Why they got me in here with this fucking Benedict Arnold ass? When it come down to it, I'm smoking you. I'm smoking hey, all y'all. I guess you're starting your day with me. We're loading magazines. You better not let me get my hand on a gun. Well, that's it. You got it. I'm not bonding with you. I'm not bonding with you. Don't even try to make it that way. I suppose I owe you an apology. I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge, and I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. But now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. You are. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. I truly believe that was the intent. That's because it's your fault. You led them to us. If I could change it, I would. I promise you. And I should believe you now. All I know about you is that you're a liar. I understand you're mad at me, and you've got every right to be. But I wanted you to know I regret my part in all this. I apologize. Which don't account for much, but it's all I can offer right now. Nah, bro. I don't give a fuck about that, man. The guy who helped you, he got smoked because of you. How was your first night in the yard? I know it ain't so comfortable. You mean my first night in prison? It ain't a prison. More of a work release. Didn't they do those in prisons? Well, I... Clem! Probably. Clem! I don't know. Tell her! I've never been to prison. Don't tell no one. I'm trying to keep a tough reputation. Don't even smile at her, bro. I'm, I'm smoking shit. I was supposed to go. When Luke and Carlos and all them left, I was planning on leaving too. When Luke approached me about it, I, I thought he was crazy. I mean, we're safe here. We got power, we got food. They never mentioned you. No? Hmm. Huh. Uh, not even Luke? Well, I mean, that's to be expected, ain't it? You don't know me, do you? What are they gonna say? Well, Bonnie ain't here. He wouldn't know what he was talking about. I guess that could be it. <laughs> I justified not going by telling myself it's easier to try and change something that's broken than start all over. Take the situation with the herd. That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. He keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. Nobody's safe here with Carver around. You're safe if you stay on his good side. I would if I knew where it was. I mean, I, no. it ain't easy keeping his good this side. big, fed, and protected. I don't envy that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. I'm not defending what he did. That was... <sighs> I'm alive because of him. That's just a fact. He killed Walter. Only to protect his own people. Kenny could have killed us all. But he didn't. Bill overreacted. He was in the heat of the moment, and he overreacted. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they didn't line up with what Bill was thinking. They butted heads, and Rebecca started showing, and that only made things worse. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. He's dead. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? I need to come get her. Yeah, she's here. Nah, Luke ain't okay, dead. Okay, I'll be right over. Luke ain't there, y'all. <laughs> I'm just joking. I'm sure it's fine. Who knows? Oh, almost forgot. I grabbed this for you. Who knows what Luke is? He probably he might be dead. Huh? What do you think? I mean, it's fresh. I look. I found it at the lodge y'all were at. I was gonna find it myself. I think it might be for scan. Had to wait for no one to be around to get it to you. I don't know. Oh, you don't like it. it it's not that. I thought it was kind of cute. 
Well, this ain't a fashion show. It'll keep you warm. You better watch yourself. I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. Oh, there you are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia! What? Never mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Tavia gonna get Come herself... On. She gonna get smoked. All of them get smoked. Follow me. Come Just on. Just because you gave me a jacket and tried to bond with me don't mean I ain't gonna clap your shit if I get the opportunity. You smoke. We are in jail because of you. And just because you a black woman don't mean I ain't gonna smoke your top either. Y'all better hope I don't get Stay a gun. in here for a minute. I'm gonna radio down and find out what you're doing. Don't touch anything. I'm touching everything, nigga. The fuck? <laughs> you better get some cojones. And women have cojones too. They just, hey. you know, up a little high. <laughs> oh! You have to be tough, Sarah. Everything is harder now, but you have to be tough to survive. That's real. My dad's never hit me before. <laughs> Even when I was really bad. <laughs> he didn't want to do it, Sarah. Carver made him. He's the bad guy, not your dad. So, in a weird way, Carver's the one that hit you, not your dad. I guess so. It's real! Carver hit me super hard. Cause it still hurts like crazy. Yeah, <laughs> it looked like it. <laughs> he knocked the shit out you. Well, thanks for trying to help. I don't know why people have to be so mean. Like, even when I'm really mad, I still don't want to hurt anyone. This guy? Don't mess this up. Yeah, I get it. Reggie's in charge here, okay? Listen to him carefully. Yep. No problem, Tavia. Fuck you, mother love. Okay, we gotta do a good job, guys. The camp is counting on us. Come on, I'll show you what to do. I should fuck it's up. Super easy. Pick up a pair of those shears. I might try to be the uh, the spook who sat by the door, bro. You know what I mean? If you know what that is, man, I'm trying to infiltrate just to get my niggas through. Okay, so we're picking these berries, right? Just pick them, put them in the basket. Simple. Hey, get tough. While you're at it, if you see any dead branches, take those shears and cut them off and stack them neatly for composting. Got it? Clementine got beat on plenty of times, you know what I'm saying? Smacked, hit, Hey, chased. so, is she gonna be okay? Because what happened down there? That was straight fucked up. I don't want her freaking out and getting me in trouble. I talked to her. I think she's okay. Good, good. Because I'm awful at that stuff. Look, Bill's had it out for me ever since I helped those guys escape, so I gotta concentrate on my work. Bro, you a me type of person, bro. Don't pat me on no head, bro. I don't know you like that. That was awkward. I won't do that again. I'm gonna go work now. Yeah, do that, creep. Man. Clem been through some, like, Clem been through some shit, you know what I'm saying? Clem been through some shit. And it's a good thing that she's been through that shit, because she don't get affected easy like this girl who's been sheltered. Let me help her out, man. She don't wind up dying. Hey. Here, watch me. For real, man. I feel like if I didn't help her, she probably wouldn't get beat the fuck up again, bro. This isn't that hard, Sarah. I know. I'm just afraid I'll make a mistake. It won't be the end of the world if you do. Just keep going. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, no. Fuck him. You didn't do any of your work, Clem. <laughs> just checking in. See how the new girls are working out. I didn't do shit. What you gonna do, hit me? Reggie. Yeah, Bell. Hey. What the fuck happened in here? Look, Bell, they're new, and me with my arm, it's just not the easy... I just have... I have one shut arm. Shut up, the... shut up. Shut the fuck up. You better have an explanation for this. And I mean now. Bill, please, just... It sounds just... like you were about to give me an excuse when I asked for an explanation. We'll get it done. Just give I us some more shit. time. Oh, Time's I don't up, know. Reggie. You had a task, and you didn't get it done. Looks to me like you failed. We talked about this, Reggie. 
didn't we? But you just don't get it, do you? Get what? I... I... Why don't you girls wait outside? Reggie and I have a few things to talk about. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Thanks for the help, girls. I could have said it was my fault, dude, but I ain't like none of those answers. I don't give a fuck. I don't care about nobody in this camp, so I'm What's not saying nobody. Sarah? Skin. Jump. You like a real scary jump. Are you okay? I no, gave no, you no, plenty no. of chances. Please, Bill. No, 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 please. Oh my God. Ah! Witness, Damn. incompetence, it puts us all at risk, and it won't be tolerated. You think about that the next time you're asked to do something. Don't give a fuck, nigga. Get downstairs. That's, that's more for her. Some stuff for you to do. Go. That's more for her. Because you ain't doing shit to me, because I'm going to get you. Oh, hey. I'm so, like the boogeyman. they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? Real simple, just take this over to them. That jacket looks real nice. I don't know what Tavia's talking about. What's wrong? Clem? You alright? Man, Carver killed you Reggie. You look feel like me? you've seen a ghost. Reggie. Reggie's dead. What? What are you talking about? Carver killed him. He pushed him off the roof. Maybe... Maybe it was just an accident. It wasn't no accident. Listen to me. Take this stuff out to those guys and come straight back. Just be safe, okay? Now ain't the time to be calling attention to yourself. I need to go find out what happened. The only way you're gonna get on my good side is if you help us get up out of here. Hey, Troy! Clem's just gonna take them boys some nails. All right. Go on. You better be working in the background to get us free. Because I swear I'm like the boogeyman. I'm going I'm to get you. Hey, that ain't your concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. Let me, th let me shout something back out at them. Like, fuck you. Oh, this is fortified really good. Nigga, buy some pieces of plank. Look at that shit. I ain't nobody's laborer. Fuck that. Let them do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn important. Get your fucking hands off you me, You ain't gonna force me to do this bullshit. I said get your hands off me. Or what? You gonna go tail on me? I'm trying to help you, asshole. Kenny, calm down. I want to, Clem, but this son of a bitch keeps I just want to get me. the work done, and... <laughs> Shit! Fuck! Grab something! We got action! We got action, boys! We got action! <laughs> 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 Good thing she got short hair. Lee would be proud. Got him. Dead in the mud, folks. Get that, get that, get that sludge out. I'm going to town. Ah! Take them legs up off. Come on, man. Pick the slush hammer back up. Got him. Get up. 
Get out of there, come on! Make me save your ass. Jesus. Fuck you, boy. You dead. Ain't no, ain't oh, no... Oh, God, you're okay. All right, enough mushy shit. You get back inside right fucking now. I'm sure they got shit for you to do in there. Now! Think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Y'all should jump Can't do a ass. simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? Jump his ass! It's three of y'all! Oh, he would've... Man, I would've had a... Man, I would've jumped his bitch ass. I feel like let one of these mother... Scared the shit out of... Ah! Ah! Stop! Hey! It's me! Luke! Yes! Luke? Man, bit the hell out of me. Think you drew blood. Come all this way. This is this is the welcome I get. I was that's worried. Real. We all were. No, it's good to see you too, kid. All right, listen, we ain't got much time. Okay, I followed y'all here best I could. I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. And, well, that's the first chance I got to talk to somebody. <laughs> They're everywhere, okay? They got guards watching everything. Shh, shh. There's a herd of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Carver mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. Yeah, I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming and it's gonna be soon. See, I've been looking for places to, to get you all free, but I haven't been able to find anything yet. I have to go. Troy will be looking for me. Uh... <sighs> What? Troy, he's expecting me back. Oh, oh, yeah, right, right. Okay, just, just one second. We just, we just need a plan. You know, a way to get you and, and everyone. Luke? Oh, sorry, sorry, shit. Okay, Troy ain't gonna like you being lean. Listen, Clem, I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just just one of those walkie-talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Look, we ain't gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. Okay, I'll get you one. Thanks, Clem. I'm so glad I can count on you. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm all right, okay? I'm worried they, uh... Get out where I can see you. Go on. Get out of here. Troy for to put hands on Clementine. I don't already like that. The hell were you doing? Huh? Answer me. I was hiding from walkers. Don't go in there, you hear me? That is off fucking limits to you. Bill Radio wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now. Yo, I had to lie. I didn't want to get our boy in trouble. Fuck Bill. When the time comes... Dude, you better go up and see Bill. He doesn't like to wait. So Fuck you! So, you should probably go. Man, fuck Bill. Fuck you with the beard. Fuck... The girl who snitched on us fucked the black woman. Rebecca. He trying to scare her. She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Get in here. Bro, what you got to say to me, bro? Oh, shit. Alvin? Alvin! He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. Why are you doing this? Me and him, we got history. Understand? A couple things we had to get worked out. I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. I'm gonna now. fuck about that fire? I'm gonna kill you, boy, and I'm gonna spit on you. You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are. And you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this after what happened earlier, but 
I liked Reggie. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. But he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will and weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. You're a murderer. You can try and call it something else. But I know what it is. What it really is. Facts. Listen, Clementine. It ain't murder. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. You understand? Nigga, who are you? Well, I You're wish it was God? different, I do. Nigga? But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. I'm not like you. I know it when I see it. And we're more alike than you think. In fact, I think you realize it, but you're not comfortable with it yet. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared, but you looked me straight in the eye, kept your nerve. That's what we need if we're going to get through this. The next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way, the way my child will be raised. It ain't this hurt that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing if I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that I'm anymore. I'm about to be a bit of the I'll help you. Whatever you need. I know I'm just a kid, but I'll do my best. Well, that's all I can ask. All right, now. Bill, you there? I'm gonna get you, bro. I'm gonna get you. Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Try really knock the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't I'm think gonna get you, bro. Anything, but you don't even know it. Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. I played. I played it that way because I want him to trust me. I'm gonna kill him. I want him to feel comfortable. I'm going to kill him. Cause we I'm all know what happened this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is gonna do next. So you wanna ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Cause this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just gotta figure out a way to draw him to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous! Kenny! Do not speak to me like that. I'm not sure this is a good idea. It puts us all at risk. Thank you. The kid's the sensible one. I still vote we get Luke I didn't to do that. wait for an opening. Oh, come on! You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? There was a girl back at Crawford that used church bells to send walkers all over the city. We just need something really loud. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. I meant There's some speakers outside Kenny, the building. Pointed toward the parking lot. I saw him when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. He's right. I saw them too. Really? It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just gotta get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Kenny, why can't we do both? 
Even if we bring the herd to us, it's probably good for Luke to be able to tell us where they're coming from. You know what? Fine. I can get behind that. Okay, so we get that turd radio. He keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured that's out true. what your problem is. You don't think he this don't. stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually... I do it all the time. She kind of thick. Ooh. First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. Hush. What do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. Now I don't know who's crazier. Trust me. I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. You seem to know what you're talking about. I've done it too. What? It's how we got out of the Marsh House. Lee covered me, and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. All right, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that, too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Where the hell did she come from? Girl got buns of steel. We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then, just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Great. That thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come on. Up and at him. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. Hi, Steer. That's my girl. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Come on, kid. Man, you know Clem ain't scared. Don't let go. I got you. I feel like this ain't gonna work. <laughs> Damn. Try to hurry, all right? I don't think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. What you want me to grab on to, bro? You're not in your bunk. We're all done. Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. <laughs> oh shit! We're in trouble. Yo, so I'm gonna go ahead and end it right here, man. Hopefully this guy doesn't turn around before I end it. But I hope y'all stay safe. Unlike these people right here. Stay the fuck out of trouble and I'll holler at y'all in the next one. Peace out.